Justin Smoke credits so much of his success to his father, both in the way he plays and approaches baseball. So when he lost his dad, his mentor and his best friend to lung cancer on the night of April 19th, he was obviously crushed. And while Justin didn't make it back from Seattle before Keith passed, the 24 year old is taking an unselfish approach to the loss. I talked to him every day. I stayed in touch with him every day. And, you know, it's. I think it was a good thing, you know, he's, he's not suffering no more. He's not trying to, you know, he's not in pain. Pain remains for Justin and the rest of his family. However, the rising Major League star has an extended family. Those from his hometown of Goose Creek and the Stratford High community. Oh, it was overwhelming. I mean, I've, I mean, when they said we had 400 some people at the viewing, it was pretty cool, you know, to, to know, you know, that he touched so many lives and, you know, it was, it was awesome, I think. One way to handle grief is to focus on good memories. And Justin will always be thankful his dad was alive for two of the biggest moments in his life. His major league debut last spring and his wedding this past winter. He was gonna see no matter what. And you know, he was you know, it's it's cool to it's cool to know that he was there for all those and you know he's still gonna be there for all you know for all these in the future. Now, many wondered how Justin would do when he returned to the Mariners a week after his father's death. Those at Comerica Park in Detroit saw firsthand. Hit the left field and deep. Rayburn going back. He's at the track. He's going to watch this one. Leave the yard. Welcome back, Justin Smoke. A home run in his first game back. No surprise, his mind was racing when he returned to the dugout. Oh, man, it was a lot of mixed emotions, you know. I mean, excited and at the same time just knowing that he was there i mean that was the biggest thing he actually homered the following night too and currently leads seattle in homers and runs batted in and now justin has a new appreciation for the game and for the field it truly is his escape it's good to be doing something i love doing and knowing that he would love from you know love would want me to be doing and you know knowing that he's got the best seat in the house at every game you know i think it's the best you know the best part of it Justin has plenty of great memories of his father. The most recent one that stands out happened more than three months ago at Carolina Stadium in Columbia. USC head coach Ray Tanner opened the stadium to his former star, Keith, and the rest of the Smoke family so they could see father and son play catch one last time. Raphael?